It's Sunday. That means we get to solve the Sunday puzzle. The biggest puzzle of the week. The one with the title. Here it is. Doing donuts. What could it mean? I mean, I can see the uh, we can see the grid already partially there, and we got we got we're gonna go around here. Do we have to travel in this direction? Is this gonna be the shape of a zero, like the uh, like there's maybe there's another zero in there? I don't know. Like uh, like you're, you're I don't know. I don't know. We're gonna have, maybe have Rebus also fill in the letter zero, the, the the number zero for the shape. Maybe it stands for things like nada or zero or zil or nil. I mean or zilch. I don't know. Maybe 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 we have like the word dough. D-O-U-G-H. I don't know. Let's find out, shall we? Let's find out what this is all about. Let's. So, oh, Jeff Chen and Julian Trink Ali Golden are the constructors. And I'm Steve. I'm the solver. And I'm going to find out what's going on here starting now. Okay. Whoa, it is going. Ooh, it looks kind of cool. Pieces of phrase or odes. And we'll get there. Some blackjack wagers. I don't know. Red leader. Uh, I don't know. Mega celebrity is a diva. Uh, oil industry acronym. I don't know that. Hot sauce with a reduplicative name. Don't know. Something hot sauce with says something twice. I don't know. Case study. I don't know. Uh, I declare this donut. Oh, okay. I declare this donut to be a truly tasty treat. Delicious. Yum. I don't know. Host. I don't know. Makes as money as earns. Podcast. Como estas? Bien. ¿Y tú? Como estas tú? Host is Eb host hot sauce something with a reduplicative name teriyaki something yaki yaki something something this could mega celebrity could that not be diva because then so, ai ai would be a reduplicative name something mahi mahi it's not a hot sauce hmm case study i don't know luggage uh, i declare this donut i don't know all right let's go up here let's do the next section uh d lister's quest to get on the c list i don't know uh, come to think of it, hmm, uh, when double the flight, CC, uh, there we go, CC fly, symbols and social media handles would be ats, right, like your uh, hashtag, not uh, hashtag your ats, um, clothing, I don't know, apparel, doesn't fit, uh, bones, could be anything, could be dice, Sonicare, competitor, oral B, uh, civil rights activist, Sylvia, presidential member of freedom, I don't know, let's get rid of, hmm, for come to think of it. Uh, say, you know what? Definitely leave it to me. Yes, I can. Uh, early critics said, can't, I can't sing Balding Fred Astaire. Can dance a little. All right, D-Lister's quest is stardom. Is to get on the A-list. Okay, Sylvia Mendez. Uh, S or Z, I'm not sure. Clothing is ra raiment. Raiment blends is melds. Ra raiments, like that, okay. Uh, source of division at a wedding was the aisle. Uh, Chateau Saint Michel, like that, right? French style. Uh, headed up is lead something. Items of apparel, my favorite thing. These are a few of my favorite things. I don't know. TV cousin is it. Oh, and warm woolen mittens. Uh, that's what they are. Doesn't move, stays. Um, sits. It just sits there. Sign of a cell. S R O. Standing room only. Uh, I don't know who Dawson is in the hung Hunger Games mocking Jake Stan stew. I don't know. Stan fits, but I don't know. Here's one way to eat a donut without getting icing on your nose. Frosted tip. Oh, that's a frosted tip. Ah, okay. Yeah, so these these are phrases that, that, that about donuts that work and is donut shaped. All right. Fried, com fixed completely is per uh, perfect. I don't know. Um, par. I don't know. Indeed, quaintly, I don't know. Uh, Sylvia Mendez blows past, zips by. Let's do that with a Z. Download in progress. Don't know. Status bar. Fufara is a stir. Uh, Amy Winehouse hit. I try to get to get try to make me go to rehab. I said no, no, no. Two thousand six. Well, that was a long time ago. Okay. Um, yeah. Pithy review. Loved it. Hated it. Something like that. Uh, German lead into house. I don't know. Uh, Andrew alternative is Bosch. Those are pairs, pair brands. Opposite of Baja is Alta. Uh, not low, but high. A Japanese noodle dish is Udon. Bauhaus. Yep, that is uh, the architecture people. Uh, this donut would be great dipped in milk. Ooh, I don't know. Um, brought popular in Brooklyn streets. They played stoop ball back in the day. When I was your age, we played stoop ball. With a pink, we had a spalding. Okay, uh, 
What has a good coverage? I, I, I'm trying to sound like Abraham Simpson, but he didn't grow up in uh, in Brooklyn. So there we go. Uh, what has good coverage for retirement? Retirement? Is it? Is it? Is it canopy? Ca, 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 canary? I don't know. Work up is to I don't know. When we'd have something down by rote? No, it's definitely stoop ball. Okay, pithy review. Uh, something it, right? Something down. Hmm, I don't know. I don't know. Work up. I don't know. What do we have here? Good coverage for retirement. Something canopy bar. Can, 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 can. Egg foo young. Uh, oh, this would be great. Fish dipped in milk. Old fishing tale. Old fishing story. Old fisher. Old fisher. I don't know. Download in progress is a beta bet. Beta, I like beta. Pithy review. Aced it? As blows past, I don't know. I aped it. I don't like that. Uh, work up. Uh, I don't like that at all. Um, this don't, we get old Fisher's? Fisher's tail? Old fish, I don't know. Uh, indeed, oh, okay, we'll get, we'll get these. Symbol of freshness, as fresh as a daisy. That's what it is. I declare this donut to be a truly tasty treat. I still don't know. Uh, final opponent is the boss in many video games. I learned that from doing crossword puzzles. Um, the boss level. Mazatlan, Mula would be money in Mexico or pesos. Some blackjack wazers are something bets. Um, I don't know. Uh, all right, I declare this donut to be a truly tasty treat. It doesn't look right. Is this earns, makes as money, coins? It's still an N. Something about that, I don't know. Case study, average, no. Case, case, case. I don't know. Hot sauce, pari pari. I don't know, that doesn't seem right. Hmm. I don't know, I don't know. Okay, well, we're not getting any other help from this one. Uh, and I don't like host is a lot, is a mob. All right, rather than ebb. So makes as money is mint. And they mint the money. Okay, here we go. I declare this donut to be a truly tasty treat. Is that you're taking a stand there. What kind of a stand? It's not a last stand. It's a uh, frosted tip. So it's got to be a donutty word in there. All right, so this last, okay. Huh, I don't know. I don't know. What is this, Orcas podcast? Oh, yes, Orcas, like a group of podcasts. Okay. Um, Piri Piri sauce? Is that is that a thing? It fits. Never heard of it, but maybe it is. Uh, blackjack waiters would be side bets. Case study would be evidence. Uh, oil industry Adam OPEC is in the oil industry. I never thought of them as an acronym, but it totally is. Um, organization Petroleum Exporting Countries. Um, a cake, cake stand. Oh, cake stand. <laughs> Errol, Eric the Red. Oh, very good. Okay, Eric the Red, the, uh, the explorer, the Viking, whatever. Uh, I declare this donut. You're taking a stand on cakes. Well, donuts are a type of cake. Okay, and a cake stand is a thing. Cube root, a cube's 12. A cube has 12 uh, edges, not 12 faces. It has six faces, 12 edges, and eight vertices. Here we go. Symbol, I don't know. Get, uh, I don't know. I'll bet you dollars to donut some sort of a wager. Gentleman's wager. No, that's, um... Hmm. We need a we need a donity word in there, so it can't just be gentleman's wager. Turn into a puddle is melt like Olaf in summer. In summer, uh, la perla la purchases. I don't know. Symbol is an emblem. Uh, to get is to I don't know. Bet your dollars to donuts glazed. Something maybe. Uh, la perla la purchases to make bras. It fits. Why not? Uh, alternative to Betsy is Liz for Elizabeth. Eliza and Peggy. Uh, a night before is the eve. Um, a med student. Yes, to get is to derive glazed something. I don't know. Mid East rulers could be emirs. That fits there too. Inside an ellipse are foci. Math. Okay. Uh, annual vaccination limit can s limit its spread the flu virus. The annual vaccination. I should get mine. Uh, it's ready. I hear. Is it ready? The new flu virus? I'm going to go get it. Okay, thank you, Crosswords. Uh, <laughs> telenovela is uh, is a show, I guess. Um, let me think. Um, pull up. I don't know. They're called white carrots in Scotland. Ugh, I don't know. 
I don't know, laddie. That's, I apologize, Scots. I apologize. Entire UK. Really, I should apologize to all of you. Um, that was pretty bad. Um, Japanese noodle joint is a ramen something. I don't know about almond show. One of those is not right, but Japanese noodle joint is a ramen ramen place. Ramen smlach. Something's not right there. Okay. Lady Day is Billy Holiday. Stew is to fume. Pulls rank on is over rules. Over rules. Let's raise a glass. Raise a glass to this outstanding donut. Wow, two Hamilton references in one. Um, <laughs> something sort of a toast. Cinnamon toast. Ah, that's a good one. I like that one. Okay, ramen. Okay. Uh, cheer squads try. Ra, ra, ra. Garfunkel goes with Simon. It's over rise, not over rules. Okay. Um, hello, darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk with you again. To treasure is to adore because they're women. They will, they will, because they something softly sleeping. La, 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 la. Okay, Trattoria Bowlful is uh, another type of noodles, maybe. Um, Mark in a shell game is a sap. Oh, penne. Uh, yeah, penne's delicious. Originally named Ne, bo literally born in French. Interrupts when it's not one's place to do so. Horns in on. Uh, what's the streets? Yep, number streets. Yeah, okay, get ready for a Ms. Olympia contest. It's oils up if you're a bodybuilder. Uh, fixed completely is pure. I don't know. Pure and uh, pure new natural leaders are Leos. Are we? I don't know. Um, perhaps it's uh, okay. Subway stops or stations. Uh, indeed, quaintly. So forsooth. <laughs> that is quaintly. What is stuff? Really? Dawson stuff? How about Steph? I like that better. Um, I don't know, but it just seems a little bit better. Okay, fixed completely is para, para, I don't know. Maybe it is pure, I don't know. Uh, isn't everybody? What? Okay, get something straight irons. Maybe like your hair, right? Use a flat iron. It is an undeniable fact that this donut is awesome. A uh, permanent is uh, is the word here. This, this is some some sort of truth, and this is permanent. Um, oh, Mr. Sun, 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 would you please shine down? Wait, no, not Mr. Blue Sky. No, uh, oh, Mr. Sun, something like that. Won't you please shine down on me? Please shine down on me. Oh, Mr. Sun. Oh, how does that song go? I don't know. Um, Mr. Golden Sun, something like that. All right. Uh, pithy review. No idea. Maybe is, is it not Mr. Sun? I want to play something like that, Mr. Sun. Uh, one way to ha have something down is... Uh, what the heck? Okay. Work up. I don't know. Old fishing... Uh, bah. Old fish... Mama. Canopy. Okay. A download in progress is beta app. Old fashioned. That's what that is. This donut, this donut would be great dipped in milk. Old fashioned is a type of donut. Um, let's see. Have something down. Rote is what I want to put here. Canopy. Good coverage for retirement. How would have something down cold? You have something down cold. Uh, work up is to rile up. Canopy bed. For retirement, so this time retirement means sleeping. You go to oh, retire for the night and have coverage, coverage because it's a canopy bit. Okay, that works. What is aperçu? Oh, that's like a French word. I think it means like a, a review in French. It's not the review itself. It's it's the, the name for the review, not like the words of the review. I think that's a French. I've seen that maybe. Treebeard is an ent. Uh, many fans of the Enola Holmes, I believe, are that is aimed at tweens. Uh, Nelson Mandela. Uh, and Winnie also, six letters, but Nelson fits this one. Corsica is an island in France, France, off the coast of France, so Il will go with French. Inventory abbreviation, I don't know, is merchandise. Uh, long span of time is an eon. Old fashioned idea, oh, okay. Like those celebrating a day of visibility would be trans. Snickers alternative are Mars bars. Uh, their first five parts are often disguised. Hmm, I don't know. Uh, or informed delivery, the USPS. I subscribe to that. Uh, it's cool. You get a, a mail, an email of your mail for the day, or if there's packages in there. The Promised Land, um, Canaan, but that doesn't fit. Uh, Eden, it's not promised. Let's say nukes. Uh, I'm not sure. This donut is the talk of the town. Some sort of a buzz. Um, 
the promised land. Oh, Zion is the promised land. There you go. Uh, nukes, uh, zaps. Oh, as a verb, uh, if you like nuke your donut for 15 seconds, it's delicious. In the microwave, you can zap it. Their first five parts are often disguised. Oh, yeah, social security numbers. Yep. Frozen, why five? Otter Pop would be a frozen uh, playful animal. Mickey Mouse is in Fantasia and the Wizard's Cap and the Sorcerer's Apprentice. Is that, that it? Yeah, I think so. Uh, Dense Cake is a tort. Let's see. Author of something in uh, Latin. How about Dante? Uh, Banded Gemstone is an agate. Uh, popular tabloid subjects are UFOs. Are they? I haven't read the tabloids in a while. Get it? See? Sugar buzz, because sugar type of donut. Okay. Lure in the Odyssey is the siren. The voice was so attractive, it drew the sailors to their death. Uh, down tempo electronica genre, some sort of a pop. Not just a uh, is the. No, it's some sort of a hop. Uh, rough translation podcaster is that on NPR? They have podcasts. Why not? A uh, kid often named Trey is somebody the third. Uh, they're called white carrots. I still don't know. What kind of truth is this that fits in here? I don't know. Um, skip hop? I don't know. Flip hop? I don't know. Ramen? Oh, something here is wrong. Flu virus I like. Ramen, Japanese noodle joint. Ramen stand? Ramen shop? I don't know. Um, pull up? I don't know. All right, let me think. Uh, how about that? Ramen shop that works there. Uh, telenovela is... That W can be gone. Telenovela is a soap uh, in Espanol, but it's a soap opera. Okay, pull up is to uh, halt. Stop. The plain. Oh, plain truth. Because plain is a type of donut. Very good. They're called white carrots. Uh, trip hop. I like this. Oh, parsnips. Are they really? Okay. Uh, keep going. I don't know. Magazine real estate column inches. I don't know. Uh, small houses in the southwest. Casitas. Ah, uh, little, little little house in the, in the Sp in Spanish. Casita is what they call this house in uh, in Encanto, but that wasn't the Southwest. That was Colombia. I guess that's Southwest America. Um, that's a stretch. Uh, word with to work or set phasers to stun. Uh, let's all I'm all set to work. Okay, coolers or air conditioners. Mai Tai is a type of uh, drink. Uh, former governor of Georgia, the Czar, used to govern. Uh, with a with a, not not like uh, yeah okay not the not the governor of the state of Georgia but the country of Georgia was a Soviet socialist republic before that I guess it was part of the Russian Empire so it could have been ruled by the Tsar keep going is to persist nevertheless I persist uh, magazine real estate what snap base pa 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 could be page there I don't know uh, A B C or D but rarely E would be a grade uh, because usually in this country you get uh, Oh, it could be czar with a C. I don't know. Hmm. Like a baseball show. Oh, USSR. Not. I, I said it was a Soviet Socialist Republic. Okay. Um. So there we go. USSR. Not a person, but the country that ruled. Uh. That run, ran. Uh. Georgia. Okay. Here we go. Bit of movie theater candy is a snow cap. Ad space was there for the magazine. Uh, like a baseball shout out is no run. A one-eyed god. Odin. Did Odin have one eye? I don't know. You fit. You have four letters. You're a god. Uh, heading on a certain neighborhood poster. I don't know. Wanted. Uh, selling, maybe. I don't know. Uh, missing. Oh, missing. Like the neighborhood, like a missing dog, missing cat kind of thing. Hotbeds of tourist activity. I don't know. Uh, massages. I don't know. DEA agent is a narco. Uh, let's see. Hotbeds are meccas. Literally, mecca is a hotbed of religious tourism. Uh, prefix menu. Go with that. Like rocks or clocks, but not a fox and ox and box and socks. Okay, uh, sorry, rocks or clocks, uh, inanimate, but ah, oh, fox or ox, those can move, those are animate, I like that. A genre for George Clinton or Earth, Wind and Fire is funk music, play that funky music till you die. Okay, I know that's not George uh, Clinton, uh, or is it, is that Parliament Funk Dog, is that P-Funk? No, because he's not the white boy. Uh, play that fucking music, why, boy? But uh, when I say funk music, that is in the title of the song. Okay, little copper is sent, right? It's a little, it's little, and it's made of copper. Me as well. I too. Uh, pass quickly through is uh, I don't know. Certain filler words are ums. Oh, there's ums. This is needs as massages. Uh, unlike or likely to offend is un PC. Glazed expression. I'll bet you dollars to not and to sail through quickly. Yeah. Do do do. Oh no, I, I hit boo doo. I, hit, I muted something earlier and I forgot to unmute it. Do 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 do. Ah, that happens every now and then, uh, but that's okay. 
that's okay. To err is human, and err also shows up in the uh, in the uh, crossword puzzle. Some say air. I usually say air by itself, and err when I go with two, because uh, two air is human. Doesn't sound. All right. Anyway, back to the puzzle. So it the title, of course, doing donuts. And uh, nothing super crazy about this one. It is uh, phrases. Uh, we have we have grid art. We have a donut mostly. Um, they take crossword rules and they allow some ins and outs of there. Uh, so it's not uh, we don't have isolated sections of the crossword. We could for a theme, I guess, but they chose not to. Um, and oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. That's the song. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun. Something says, so da, da. these five children are asking you to come outside so we can play with you, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun. Please shine down on, please shine down on, please shine down on me. Yeah, that's for kids who can do harmony there. That's what it was. I remember that song. Okay. Uh, Piri Piri sauce is a thing. All right, let's do the, 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 the theme first, then we'll look stuff up because I've never heard of Piri Piri sauce. Um, is it good? I'll try some. Okay. All right, here we go. So it's all phrases that are phrases in and of themselves, but the first word or one of the words is a type of donut. So we have cake stand. A cake stand is a thing. It's a thing. It's a it's a, like a little little stage that you put a cake on. But a cake stand uh, is if you take a stand as to a cake donut. I declare this donut to be a truly tasty treat because a cake donut is a type of donut, and you're gonna take a stand. So I declare. Uh, and then we have frosted tip. Right, so you could go get your hair done, you get your tips frosted, right? I could do that. Uh, but here's one way to eat a donut without getting icing on your nose. That's a tip about donuts. Uh, we have cinnamon toast. I like this one. Let's raise a glass to this outstanding donut. Cinnamon donut is a type of donut, and a toast to cinnamon donuts is a cinnamon toast. Uh, we have down here the plain truth. I really like that one. It, it's, it's the truth. It is an undeniable fact. It's the truth. And of course, plain is a type of donut. Nothing about sour cream. You couldn't work in sour cream. Um, that would have been cool because I really like a good Tim Horton sour cream donut. Uh, un, uh, un, uh, what do you call it? Uh, un, un, uh, unsolicited advertisement. I am a big fan. There's not many where I live. Um, but uh, Tim Hortons, I, I, I believe their donuts are superior to both Krispy Kreme and Dunkin' Donuts. That's my opinion. Uh, okay, sugar buzz. So the talk of the town, it's the buzz. And of course, sugar donut, uh, sugar is a type of donut, and a sugar buzz is a phrase all by itself. You could eat too much sugar, you get a sugar high or a sugar buzz. Uh, then we have some long down entries. I'll bet you dollars to donuts. That's an expression, right? It's a, it's a phrase that has donuts in it. It's not about donuts, literally, uh, but it's a phrase. All right, I'll bet you dollars to donuts that uh, the sun will rise tomorrow. Uh, I bet it will. Um, I'll bet you dollars to donuts that Steve solves the puzzle. Uh, I probably will, right? It's a good bet. Okay, um, anyway, so glazed is a type of donut, and if you have a glazed expression on your face, that's a phrase too. So I like how expression means something totally different. It's an expression of words, a glazed expression on your face. So that's good. And the last big one we had here was old-fashioned idea. I guess an old-fashioned donut is a type of thing. Is that a specific phrase? Is that a specific flavor of donut? Or is that just... Uh, just they make the style. Oh, we have old fashioned donuts here. I'm not sure, um, but I, I think I have heard of old fashioned donuts. I think so. And an old fashioned idea. Um, yeah, that's an old fashioned idea. This donut would be great dipped in milk. Well, yeah, I think everybody agrees with that. So that was pretty fun. We have the grid art combined with many uh, puns on donut seven, I think, if I counted correctly. So that was pretty good. Then there were some things that we get to learn, um, and one of them. Uh, is that La Perla is a brand of bra. Okay. Um, I'm guessing that is true. I, I guess I can uh, verify. Hey, why not verify? Okay, let's zoom out. Um, here we go. So La Perla is probably a brand of bra. La, La Fonza Butler. La Perla. La Perla Gifts. La Perla Restaurant, Riverhead. La Perla. Here we go. It is... Yep, Italian company, Saxon Avenue. Oh, they have lots of things. Lots of clothes. Um, designed by women for women. Okay. Here we go. London headquartered Italian lingerie and swimwear maker. So that makes sense. Um, and apparently they sell it at Saks Fifth Avenue. Okay. So we got that. Very good. 
Um, the Piri Piri sauce has a reduplicative name. That was a big hint, because then you only had to get half of the clue, right? I, I had half of the letters. It must be the other half. Um, I've never heard of it. And I would like to know more about Piri Piri. Piri Piri Chicken, Piri Piri Restaurant, Piri Piri Barbecue in Union, New Jersey. Uh, let's go with Piri Piri Sauce. Piri Piri Chicken Recipe. Piri Piri, is it a sauce? Sauce Recipe. Piri Piri Sauce. Oh, you can also purchase it. It is, is that Brazilian? Is that is that a Portuguese Spice Hot Sauce? Piri Piri, I, that's interesting. I, I can't say. Uh, and apparently they sell it at every market I see and at Walmart. I can't say I've ever heard of Portuguese cuisine, period. And clearly they eat food in Portugal. Um, I've never heard of a Portuguese restaurant. But there we go. Portuguese Piri Piri hot sauce. Um, is an African chili sauce made with spicy chilies. African bird's eye chilies brought to Africa by the Portuguese blended with aromatic. How interesting. But, I mean, I've heard of Brazilian cuisine, but I've never heard of Portuguese cuisine or Portuguese restaurants. And I can't think of why. I mean, surely Portugal is a substantial country. They have many, many millions of people, probably several millions of people. They have, they have soccer teams and <laughs> Cristiano Ronaldo and they have uh, uh, but I never really thought about it huh but peri peri sauce okay and they have it at Simply Delicious and that's Alita Ryder hi Alita Ryder African peri peri sauce with bird's eye chilies garlic vinegar and herbs you must have for spicy food lover huh okay Peri Peri or Piri Piri sauce. How interesting. Okay. Was there anything else? There was one other thing that I, I didn't know. Um, let's see. No, maybe. Oh, oh was, the question was, was is Old Fashioned um, a type of donut? Or is it like a flavor of donut? Or is it just a description of donuts? So I'll just search Old Fashioned. Old Fashioned recipe, the cocktail. Yeah, that's what I know. Old Fashioned... No one says donut. Recipe, drink, beef stew, candy. Old fashioned donut. There it is. Old fashioned donut. Okay. It is a place in, looks like Chicago. It is a place in Chicago. Okay. Uh, not what I had in my type of deep fried food. Here we go. Used for a variety. Of, it's in Wikipedia. Here we go. 19th century restaurant re recipes for old fashioned donuts. So in the 19 in the 1800s they called them old fashioned really uh, or maybe used in modern donut shops an old fashioned donut is usually a cake donut. Okay, prepared in the shape of a ring with a cracked surface and tapered edges. A variety of cake donut. Okay. There you have it. And it's also a donut shop in Chicago. All right. Um, and they, here's a recipe. Okay, so it is definitely a type of donut. All right, that was the, the question that I had. I think that does it for today. I think I'm happy looking things up and learning a little bit about donuts. And maybe, just maybe, in honor of today's puzzle, I'm going to have a donut today. Donuts for the kids, too, you think? I mean, it was in the puzzle. So, I don't know. We'll see. I'll think about it. Even if they're on good behavior, I was like, hey, the puzzle is about donuts today. You guys want some donuts? And they're like, yay, donuts. They would go nuts for donuts. All right. Uh, that, I think on that rhyme, it's time to end this, this uh, video. So thank you so much. Hey, go nuts by liking this video and by subscribing to the channel if you haven't yet. If you already had, find a friend and ask them to subscribe. Yeah. Or get on your social media and share it. It's like, you'll go nuts for donuts today on this puzzle, um, or, or not. And now we're gonna have fun. I think we're gonna have some go nuts in the title. Um, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. All right, have a wonderful day. Have a wonderful end of your weekend. And I will see you in the future. Come back to the channel. Don't let this be the last. Um, just keep on coming back because I plan to keep doing this because it's fun. And that is a good reason as I can think of. So thank you so much for being part of the, uh, part of the fun, part of the audience. I love you all for it. Have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful day. And I will see you in the future. Bye-bye.